We start tonight, though, with that urgent manhunt underway right now in Pennsylvania for this escaped inmate. Michael Burham was being held on arson and burglary charges. He is also a homicide suspect. News Nation's Dre Clark joining us now from Warren County Jail in Pennsylvania. And Dre, police say this man is a survivalist and has military training. Yeah, Natasha, good evening. Investigators say so far they have found several small campsites that they believe uh, are associated with Michael uh, Burham here. Investigators have been searching around homes and through the woods within the search radius. Investigators say because Burham is a self-trained survivalist with military experience, he is prepared to withstand the elements and he knows exactly what to do on terms of how to hide himself to avoid capture. Now, Burham escaped from the Warren County Jail on Friday night here in Pennsylvania after climbing on some exercise equipment to reach a roof and then police say he used bed sheets uh, to climb down from that roof. Police say he is extremely dangerous and should be avoided. Burham is a prime suspect in the fatal shooting of a 34 year old woman in Jamestown, New York. That's about 20 miles from where we are. And he's accused of burning another woman's car also in Jamestown. U.S. Marshals say Burham is associated with the carjacking and kidnapping of a local couple while trying to escape a previous capture. Now, the Warren County Jail is just outside of the Allegheny National Forest with a shoreline that spans some 90 miles. More than a dozen federal, state, and local authorities are all involved in the search effort here. They're using drones, helicopters, and dogs to search a remote area not far from the jail. Uh, the Pennsylvania State Police have established command as the search expands throughout the county and into areas going into New York State. The U.S. Marshal is now offering a reward of more than $7,500 for information leading to Burham's arrest. Also, the Warren County County Crime Stoppers is offering a $2,000 reward. Most of the manhunt is on foot because of the rough terrain, and authorities say they cannot stress enough how dangerous Burham is, and they're urging local residents to be extremely vigilant. We are considering him armed and dangerous, and we are cautioning residents if they see him or believe that uh, he may be anywhere near them, that they should not attempt to approach him. Now, again, police are telling everyone in this area, if they do see Michael Burham in a neighborhood in the woods, do not approach him because he is considered extremely armed and dangerous. They say call 911 right away. Natasha. Okay, Dre Clark live for us at the Warren County Jail in Pennsylvania with that update. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.